Hey Garnstead fans, it's Kimber in the kitchen. Tonight I am taking acorn squash from our garden to table. I love acorn squash. This is one of my favorite fall comfort foods and it is so easy to make. So tonight I'm gonna to show you just how easy that is. But first, when you go to harvest one from your own garden or if you're gonna purchase one, make sure you're choosing one that is ready. When you get one, look at the back for an orange spot. You just wanna have a nice bright orange spot where it was sitting in the field and then also try and press your thumb into the side. And if it doesn't press in easily, then that means that it is ready. If you can press it in, it's not ready yet if you're down in your garden or if you're at a store, it's probably past its time. So choose one that is a bit heavy for its size, that has a great orange spot, and that you can press your nail to and it doesn't go in easily. Don't be like our three-year-old and choose the itty-bitty, teeny tiniest one in the garden. I think this one could probably go in the microwave. But we are going to take this beautiful one and we are going to cook it in the oven tonight. And it's very easy to do. They're actually kind of hard to cut into. So you can go ahead and grab a sharp knife and cut it in half. You're going to want to cut it from stem to bottom, but it can be kind of tough. So a good trick is to get a few pokes around the sides and put it in the microwave on high for three minutes and that will soften up the exterior so that you can slice it in half better. And I really like to do that, save a little bit of that arm muscle for down in the garden. Once you've cut your acorn squash in half, you're gonna see the beautiful inside where it's full of seeds and stringy mess. You're gonna to wanna to get a spoon and a bowl and scoop that part out. And you can actually save that for another time and roast those seeds just like you would with pumpkin seeds. They are absolutely delicious. So I'm gonna scoop these out and then I'm gonna place them into a foil lined baking dish. And I'm gonna put in a dollop of butter and a little bit of brown sugar. And I'm just gonna place them in the oven for an hour at 350 degrees. And that's it. It is that simple to make acorn squash for dinner. And it's absolutely delicious and you're going to love it. Okay, it has been an hour and the acorn squash are finished. They smell absolutely delicious. I am so excited for dinner tonight. Can't wait to see how yours turned out as well. Please share in the comments. 